Hi, so I wanted to bring everyone up to date because the last time we spoke um, uh, over the summer we were talking about some issues with COVID-19, um, specifically if someone contracted it at the workplace and also what to do in terms of navigating doctor appointments, uh, therapy sessions, things of that nature. Uh, so what happened was after the uh, official shutdown, um, people were on hold with doctor visits, physical therapy visits, uh, IME examinations, independent medical examinations, and then things started to loosen up and people were able to get back in to see their doctors. They were able to go for physical therapy again and attend uh, independent medical exams. Uh, this is always a concern in a workers' compensation case because people want to see their doctors. They want to get their therapy. And uh, there was even a time where elective surgeries, uh, other than emergencies, were not happening. So now things have been flowing well, which is good. And there are a lot of safety protocols in place, as we all know, with the doctor's offices and at the hospitals. Um, but a happening and what if we go into a lockdown again or there's going to be limitations and the best advice I can give is we're taking it day by day and week by week and we get directives from the workers compensation board as to what people should do right now I'm telling people use your own judgment you can attend any appointments that you feel safe to attend safety protocols are still in place uh, physical therapists are still working. Everybody does want to still continue to work and do things to the best of their ability to make sure everyone gets treated and the cases move smoothly. Uh, there is also telehealth still happening with all of the doctors and this is excellent for people who are high risk because even if you can't physically get out to the doctor and you still feel high risk, I know I have certain clients who are doing physical therapy sessions via telehealth, via Zoom, uh, you can get a home exercise program assigned to. So you can still keep up with things that are important for your health and for your injuries. And, you know, heading into winter, we're all feeling kind of uncertain. So I think the main thing is that we have to work together. And uh, we have to, like I said, day by day, week by week, see what unfolds. But the main thing is um, to put your mind at ease that there are protocols in place and the Workers' Compensation Board and insurance carriers have really been working with us to ensure that everything is handled appropriately. We're all in this together, and that's what we have to keep on doing and keep moving forward.